Well, what a game we have in store for you. Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. And it's match day one in the group stage for these two nations here at the 2023 Women's World Cup. It's Germany against Morocco. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. And here's how Morocco will line up. Well, they're also playing in a 4-3-3 formation, but they play it in a slightly different way, particularly in the wide areas, where their fullbacks will get forward and rotate with the wingers at every opportunity. is underway Amani giving it a try there it is the opening goal of this match and what a start they've made Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. And so Germany get the ball moving again. Can they find a response here? Schuler. Has eyes for goal! Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. And behind it's gone for a corner. Delivering it. Not all that convincing defensively. This could level it. In it goes! But wait a minute, that will not count. Well, that was tight. It was a good finish, though.
Just the challenge that was required. Fatima Tanyau. Zara Debritz. Oh, that pass easy on the eye. Oh, no, not what she had in mind. Absolutely not. Had she scored that, they would have been level. That's a big, big chance that she's missed there. Amani. Good looking sequence. And a goal kick is the outcome. Lea Schuler. Here's Pop now. She's made a really good intervention there. Gislan Shebak. Ayan. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. A glorious chance. No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? Magul and taking it away Amani Ayan Rosera Ayan in with a chance and there it is, the goal they wanted for security. They lead by two now. They can breathe that bit more easily. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. So the ball rolling again, 2-0 the score. Pop. Now with Schuler. Felicitas Rauch. Shot attempted. The save was a good one. Favouring the short one. It's one corner after another. <laughs> Taken short. Hegering. and give them hope that they can turn this round. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal.
Moving once more, and Germany right back in this contest now. Rosera Ayam. And that is how to block. Really good high press. And the referee blows the whistle. It is a free kick. And three minutes of stoppage time to be added on. Magul. Moving forward effectively. Opportunity here. Save, but still a chance. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. So the second half underway with Germany chasing the game. Can they turn this around? Opportunity to deliver the cross. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Useful looking position, you've got to say. But timely defending when it mattered. Schuler. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. Oh, it might happen for her here. Fantastic piece of goalkeeping. Well, she showed her class there. Closes the angle down, makes herself big. It's a really good stop. And the short option preferred. And still looking for space. Now closed down straight away. Terrific save. Now, will they do it from here? Well, what a stop that was. Well, as you can see from the stats, their general play has been excellent. They've dominated the play, they've created chances, but the finishing has been really... After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Substitution time it is here. And nicely struck. Oh, so near. Off the post. No nonsense clearance. Well, had that gone in, they would be in complete control of this game. As it is, they're still going to be a bit nervy. But it should boost their confidence that they can't afford to drop their guard at the other end. A very timely interception. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. But a crucial intervention inside the box. Sven Yahoot. On to Debritz. Oh, surely. Oh, a goal! Level now. The lead has evaporated. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. Not many sides would have the mental strength to bounce back from adversity like this team. Fatima Tanyau. It's neat passing, confidence on the ball. Well, not giving the opposition a look in, that strong play. And still trying to get the shot off. Splendid defense.
defending. They've got it now, what can they do? Just ten minutes to go. Mrabet. Yasmin Mrabet. Nezrin Elshad. Gislan Shebak. On the offensive, is there to be late excitement? Can they forge ahead? Oh, good save to keep them level. Well, at this stage of the game, that's a vital stop. Fantastic from the keeper. Who's going to get on the end of it? Lena Oberdorf. Pop. Now with Magul. Well, that's wonderful attacking play. Terrific block. And a penalty awarded. Spot kick coming up. And with play stop, they will make the change now. To give them the lead here. A goal! Calmly taken spot kick. Well, here it is again. Great composure to send the keeper the wrong way before striking it into the opposite side. That's an excellent penalty. Goal. On with the game then. 3-2. What will happen next? And the final whistle, the big story here, Germany have prevailed. Stuart, your analysis. Yes, Derek, sometimes it takes a while to eventually get the better of the opposition, and that was the case here. They kept going, and they eventually got their reward.